Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Millennial Pocket Watching. It's me, T. So, I'm still in the last place I am or was if you saw my last video. If not, little recap I have moved, I'm temporarily away. This is fake money because I cannot have, I don't have access to a bank and I can't get to one. So, um, in lieu of, I'm still cash stuffing, but a lot of my actual expenses are automated. But for demonstration purposes, I'm using fake money until I have access to real cash and can actually stuff cash again. So, bear with me. I am trying my best. I'm also a little behind, so I'm trying to catch up. So, don't at me, bro. I'm doing my best with what little I have. That said, um, let's jump right into it. So, paycheck number four of March. Yay. Um, so for this paycheck, this is from my third job. I I don't know what to say, guys. I, I just keep getting jobs. Um, so this is from technically my third job. Um, it's like a really small once a month thing. So yeah, so for this pay period, I received $259 um, for this paycheck. I know it's super tiny, but every little bit counts. Um, I did receive actually more for this check, but I allowed it to have that put towards my retirement um, because it's connected to an old retirement account that I have. Um, I actually do want to fluff that up some. Um, so most of that paycheck has actually gone to my retirement for this particular um, job. So this is what I have left, $259. And we're still gonna stuff it. So I'm gonna pick out the, this binder. And I'm gonna hope that I'm right. If not, it's okay. So, <laughs> clothes doesn't get anything, car doesn't get anything, travel. Travel is getting $150 because um, I moved, I moved a lot. And I need to fluff this back up because traveling is expensive. So that's going to be $150. So that's going to be $150 so undramatically. Um, and I still do have some money in here. Um, and then I will take that out later. Once my lovely credit card, and a lot of people are scared of the word credit card, but I have to keep money and statements all in one thing. One, because your credit card... Um, it covers you in case of weird purchases um, or loss for whatever. There's like insurances on it. And two, it, it just be easy sometimes, especially when you're traveling, than rather trying to fumble with cash all the time. So this will go towards my credit card statement. And I am not scared to say that I have a credit card statement. I don't. I do pay off my credit card every month, so fear not. I'm not going into debt. I'm just putting it all on my card. Anyway. 100, 50, 70, 90, 210. So I have 210 dollars for travel, and that is definitely getting gobbled up. All right, investments isn't getting anything. I'm pausing my investments while I'm in this transition phase until I go back to my regular job and regular life. Travel trailer isn't getting anything. Enrichment isn't getting anything. Moving fund isn't getting anything. Actually, I'm gonna take this out later because I did buy some stuff. Um, and gas is getting $109 because my truck, anyway, $109 for gas. So that's 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 5, 6, or sorry, 5, yep, 6, 7, 8, and 9. And that is going to go in the gas fund because trucks drink a lot of gas. So, in the gas fund, I have 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, so 219 in gas, money, which is about a tank of gas and some change, maybe a tank and half a gas. So, while it was not a lot, it was enough for what I needed it to do. Thank you guys for watching. If you like this content, please like and subscribe and thank you for sticking with me while I'm in this period of transition. I know it's not real money. It's not as satisfying, um, but I'm trying my best. So um, if you like, please like and subscribe and then I'll catch you guys on the next one. Bye.